This was the first gym I actually walked in the door of because okay. I did all my research beforehand of like, okay, these are some prices, these are reviews on Google, on Yahoo, on Facebook, and these are all the pictures I can find on the internet. What does what do these pictures say about the community involvement and the community of the gym? And so based on Google searches, I was like, okay, I think this is probably my first choice. And yeah. then I walked in, I was like, yeah, this is where I need to be. And I didn't even look anywhere else. I got here the end of February, 2020, yeah. right? So right before things went crazy, it, we had just moved here, brand new to the area. My husband was just about to deploy for what turns out to been a year. And then I think I was here maybe two weeks and then we got shut down. But I really valued you and the rest of the staff and the coaching staff showing up on Zoom, loaning out equipment. I had a barbell and some random stuff that I yeah. compiled from a Target run. It was great, but I love that, you know, your dedication to still involving anyone who wanted to be involved. I've had so many babies, so my fitness has ping-ponged back and forth so many times sure. from having four kids in four years. But I've always loved fitness and I've always been in, engaged in fitness and Back in a previous life, I was a personal trainer. I managed a gym before I had kids. And then that wasn't very conducive to military spouse life with a mom and a husband who's deployed. So I knew I needed something a little different. And having gone to the CrossFit gym while pregnant, I, I loved it. I loved just this style. And so my goal was to lose the baby weight. And I gave myself a year and I didn't make my goal. Yeah. I was, I think, 10 pounds shy of losing the baby weight. But I can tell you I am stronger than I've ever been in my entire life and yeah. have more energy and I can open jars by myself. I can carry a screaming four-year-old and a screaming two-year-old in one hand, walk up the stairs and not be winded and not even miss a beat. That's what it's more about, that it's not about the number on the scale, but it's about functional fitness. How can I show up as a mom? One of the things that I loved about CrossFit is life has been hard, yeah. about being a solo mom of four kids during a pandemic, during a year-long deployment in a new place, not really knowing anybody was just, it was literally the hardest thing I've done in my entire life. But every workout that I crushed, walking in and seeing the Metcon on the screen, I was like, oh no, this is not gonna go well. Oh my gosh. You know, but just having that and being like, oh, but I did it. Yeah. I That looks hard, but I, I overcame and I did it. That all those little moments gave me the strength and the courage to realize, okay, I'm stronger than I think to tackle all these hard things in these other areas of my life. That if I can do that one workout that I didn't think was possible in that one little time, well, gosh, I can go out and conquer my day today, tomorrow. You know, that's gonna be really hard too.